Note. R at the beginning of words is the same as R at the beginning of a syllable. For example, let's look at these words below. On the left, we have red, ran, road. They all begin with the R sound. These words on the right have more than one syllable, but the R sound begins a new syllable. So it doesn't blend with the preceding vowel. The R sound begins a new syllable. Listen, around, arrive, kangaroo. Now let me say all six words again and repeat after me. Red, ran, road, around, arrive, kangaroo. Note. In the middle position, R will often blend with the preceding vowel and then act more like a consonant. Listen carefully. Very, carrot, barroom, caring, forest, Jared. Do you hear that in each word, R first blends with the preceding vowel and then leads into the next vowel sound like a consonant? Now repeat after me. Very. Carrot. Barroom. Caring. Forest. Jared. Note. R at the end of a word will often link with the following vowel sound. For example, look at the first phrase, tear it. In normal speech, to speak smoothly, we connect our words. The R will lead into the next word, which begins with a vowel sound. We don't say tear it, but tear it, tear it. Try the linking with the other phrases. Repeat after me, fear alligators. Fear alligators. Her office. Her office. Far off. Far off. Nor am I. Nor am I. Poor aunt. Poor aunt. Exercise 5. Listen to the statements and repeat after me. Number 1. Rory is very caring. 2. Tell her you're sorry. 3. Carrots are orange. 4. Carol and Gary arrived yesterday. 5. Are there kangaroos in the forest? 6. Mary is wearing maroon earrings. 7. Some students confuse the R sound with the T or D sound, but they are different. Let's look at some examples. These three words sound the same, but the first consonant is different. Tun, dun, run. With T and D, you have contact between the tip of your tongue and that hard bump behind your upper front teeth. Tun, dun, tun, dun. With run, you do not have contact with the tip of your tongue and that hard bump. It approaches the bump, but doesn't touch. Also, the position of your lips is different. With run, there's that gentle rounding. Run, run, run. 
but with the T and D sound, your lips are more relaxed. Tun, done. Watch as I say the three words again. Look at my lips. Tun, done, run. See the difference? Okay, let's practice. Exercise 6. Listen to the text. Betty and Barry want to wed. They are ready. They aren't waiting. What's the hurry? asks Terry, Betty's mother. Yes, what's the rush? asks Teddy, Barry's father. These questions make Betty and Barry madder than a rattlesnake. Exercise 7. Listen to these three words. Rare, rear, roar. They're challenging words because they begin with the R sound as a consonant and then they end with the R sound as a vowel. Listen to the statements and repeat after me. Pay particular attention to the words in bold. Roanne wants her hamburger rare. Can you check the pressure in my rear right tire? Rena heard the roar of the river. <laughs> 